What's up everybody? This is Gaming God and we are playing walkthrough part 7 of The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. And right now, we're we just left off with saving Gerudo Town from the invasion of Gibdos and the Gibdo Queen, which was a really stressful boss battle. Like many Gibdos were chasing me were when I don't have an a chance don't have any chance to attack the, the boss but I did it anyway so yep and it's all clear and right now we are gonna be going back to 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 lookout landing to find out clues about Princess Zelda and and why she is like different from the Zelda than we know. All right, everybody, let's go to like a landing right now. Alright, I uh, work to find Pura. Alright, Pura is somewhere over there. Alright, she might be up, up, up on that deck. Oh, alright, we got Muzu. Offrack, Buliara, who else? Oh, and who's who's that flying over there? Okay, we got some Rito. Okay, Pure is up on the scope. All right, let's keep climbing. All right, there's Pura. Yeah. Linky, I heard what happened. The major cold front that descended upon the Rito, the marble rock roads that the Gorons couldn't get enough of. Then there was the sludge containing the Zora's water, and finally, the Gerudo menaced by Gibdos and the Sand Shroud. You faced some serious challenges, and you overcame them. Came, overcame all of them. Well done, Link. So the person resembling Princess Zelda was behind the scenes for all the phenomena as you discovered this has to be related to the upheaval somehow and i have something important to share as well hmm Oh, there's Zelda. Your Highness. Wow, that is <coughs> that is crazy. That's crazy. She just vanished like that after the sky was becoming the apocalypse. Huh? Linky, did you see that? That was the princess, wasn't it? I was going to share that I saw a figure that looked an looked an awful like awful lot like Princess Zelda at Hyrule Castle. I wasn't sure at first, but now I am. I thought she left the castle entirely, but she was inside. We have to hurry and rescue her. The soldiers and I can't reach Hyrule Castle as it is now. 
You, you might be the only one who can do it. Uh, uh, I'm sorry, Link. I, I know I'm always throwing you into dangerous situations. But you really are the only one up to the task. Please come back in one piece. That applies to both you and the princess. Got it? Alright, we completed regional phenomena. Alright, so all that's left is Hi Crisis at Hyrule Castle. Impa and the Geoglyphs. And find Princess Zelda. Okay. Okay, there's... There's something I want to do before I complete the rest of these, so... Maybe we'll do Impa of the... Geoglyphs. Yeah. Alright. Oh. Alright, we got Riju's avatar. Riju's vow has granted you the power to summon her avatar. Alright, so let's talk to Impa. And... And it's the, it's the elderly Impa, not the Impa from Age of Calamity. The geoglyph. Surely I could see it more clearly from up in the sky. Hmm, it's so large. I cannot clearly see the design from down here. It would be better to... I would be better... I would be better able to make it out from a high vantage point. That was why I went up in the balloon Pura gave me, alas. The wind struck and completely sheared the balloon off the base. I've tracked my brain for ways to re retouch the two parts to no avail. <clears throat> this is one of the giant pictures that I have appeared on the surface of Hyrule. I am traveling the land to see them all. Hmm, this is frustrating. Alright. So what do we have to do? <clears throat> Alright, there's a balloon here. Alright, now we have to attach it to make a hot air balloon. Oh, you fixed my balloon. Thank you, Link. Will you come with me to look at the geoglyph, then? Sure. Time to head out, then. Ah, I nearly forgot. Would you mind doing one final thing for me? Light a fire there, and the balloon will start to float. Then we can be on our way. Alright. I need a torch. Alright, there's a torch right here, but I got one over here. Alright, destroy the fuse material. Alright, we're flying now. Yes, good, higher. <coughs> Too high up, I feel faint. Ah, finally, we can see it, the geoglyph. Well done, Link. You know, I read, I read something in the village's old literature, a passage about what the ancients called the dragon's tears, where the tears rest up the earth. You mark down the images to, to which they give birth. I, I believe this geoglyph is the one such image, but even from this vantage, its, me, its meaning is no clearer to me. Nor can I figure out what the dragon's tears might be. 
but you know, if the literature is correct, one of them should be quite cl close near the geoglyph or even within its borders. Would you look? Would you look around? This could be the clues we need to dis discover Princess Zelda's whereabouts. If you would like to examine the geoglyph from above ground, you can float down with the paraglider. No need to worry about me. I can manage a simple landing. All right. Take a look at this place. All right, let's fly around. All right, this must be the dragon's tears. Was this a cutscene? Okay, there's Zelda in her Breath of the Wild uniform. What? Oh, dear. Oh, we got a new character. So that must be the queen, the first queen of Hyrule. Where am I? We didn't mean to startle you. Oh, I'm sorry. It's okay. My name is Sonia. Sonia? And could we ask what your name is? I... I am the daughter of King Rome of Hyrule, Zelda. What an unexpected answer. We are the king and queen who founded Hyrule, after all. Or at least we were the last time I checked. You two founded Hyrule? And you're the king? Mm -hmm. My name is Raru. King Raru of Hyrule. King Raru? And Queen Sonya? Alright, so we're getting, we're looking for memories now. Alright, so this walkthrough would be about finding memories. Alright. Completed input and the geoglyphs. <coughs> Link, you look distracted, what's wrong? Goodness, you say you had a vision, saw mysterious figures, and then Princess Zelda. Mm. The geoglyphs, the literature, the dragon's tears, and now a vision of the lost princess. What if these are all connected? Let us continue to examine the geoglyphs. They may contain further clues that lead to Princess Zelda. You know, according to the literature, literature there is something to do with geoglyphs in the Forgotten Temple. The Forgotten Temple lies at the bottom of the, of the canyon in Hebra. I think we should make our way there soon. Alright, the dragon's tears. Alright, how far is that? Okay, not shouldn't be that far. Let's see on the map. Okay, it shouldn't be that far.
Alright, I filmed this, just to let you know, I filmed this video last week, and yesterday I saw the Nintendo Direct, and boy, there are really exciting games that I want to, I want to do after I do Tears of the Kingdom, so I would like to do Pink Pikmin 4, which that game might be released next month, next month. And I'm not sure if I might be done with the walkthrough, walkthroughs by then. And then, there's Detect Detective Pikachu Returns, which is the sequel to the Detective Pikachu the game, not, not the movie starring Ryan Reynolds. And there is Super Mario, One Super Mario Brothers Wonder, which, is, which will also be released in October. Well, I mean, these games are, like, really exciting. Even the Super Mario Wonder game. What's most exciting is when I saw Mario turn into an elephant. That I have never seen before. Like, hopefully if the Mario movie does sequels, maybe there will be a scene when, in which Mario can turn into an elephant. And, yeah. By the way, I really didn't know that the the Nintendo Direct was gonna be in June. I hear people making like false rumors that that it was gonna be like in July and and that the Direct w was gonna be canceled in June, but it was all a lie and I fell for it. And then I realized that we just like had it. Boy, these people are, these people like these people's minds are like messed up. Okay, how how far am I right now? Okay, do I have to like climb a mountain to get to the get to the place? I think it's some meat. Oh, and uh, there's this Nintendo event in Seattle that I wish I could attend, but I don't live in Seattle or in Washington State. I live in New Jersey. Well, I believe that this could be, that the Nintendo Live event could be my second blog. But I don't think I, I don't think I'm going to have the money to like, Go to Seattle. So yeah. Alright, there's a shrine over there. But I'm like almost to the place, so I don't think I'm gonna have time to complete that shrine. Alright, this is the place. Skarn Temple. Bottom, bottom of the canyon. Oh, there's the entrance. Why did I not know that? Oh, there's Impa. Hmm, ah, Link. Heard that you and Princess Zelda have gone missing. I'm thrilled to see you alive and well. But where's Princess Zelda? Huh? I see. So Princess Zelda's whereabouts are still unknown, you say? Since that is the case, Link, then perhaps our geoglyph research will be some... Uh, be of some use to you. Alright, this is the place. Alright, let's search. I 
maybe we can have a battle. Oh. Oh, took my kill. I could have fought them. I didn't need any help. There's a shrine. Let's do that while we're looking for the for the dragon's tear. The Mayo Sai Shrine. Building blocks. Okay, this this shrine shouldn't be that bad. Hopefully, uh, it's like we're building Legos. All right. Okay, that's how you do it. Just like Legos. Just like your just like Legos. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Give me my arrow back. Oh, there's an enemy. Got a rupee. Right, I'm gonna fuse this. Blocks try to build now. But right, I did build build a square. Okay. I just had to build a square. Oops. this oops
And maybe this dude. Okay. I'm gonna do this one first. Wait, did I do this right? There we go. Alright, there's Impa. Oh Link, thank you again for your help with the balloon. I believe there is something related to the geoglyphs somewhere within this temple. I am searching, but so far it has been in vain. The chambers here are enormous, so it will be, diff be, diff be a difficult task at best. Where could it be? Alright, let's keep looking. Alright, are we here yet? No. Okay, this must be the place. Is this the place? No, not yet. Alright, just keep walking, keep walking. Okay, this must be the place. Ah, this place. Lady Impa, let's head down. We must investigate up close. Oh. There, upon the walls. Are those not geoglyphs? Hmm, what could this mean? Hmm, I believe the one we saw for first was the geoglyph on the left edge of the wall. As for the next painting... According to the floor map, it is near Rito Village. Oh. Seems the locations of the other geoglyphs in the wall are marked on the floor with, as a, on the floor map as well. I can hardly believe, believe what my eyes behold. Who could have guessed this old ruin still had held such secrets? It is said that the geoglyphs appeared all over Hyrule during the upheaval when Princess Zelda was missing. Hmm, how are they connected to these images here? There is no time to dawdle. Let, let us hurry and investigate the remaining ge geoglyphs. Oh, L Lady Empire, perhaps you should rest a bit be before such a trying journey. 
Link, if you happen to see a geoglyph during your travels, I urge you to investigate this matter as well. If more strange visions are are waiting at the other geoglyphs, just like the one you already experienced, well, perhaps they will provide clues that could lead us to Princess Zelda. Alright. I don't know where I am right now. I don't know what I'm doing. I should get a cutscene. Oh, there it is. A tear with a tear. Ah, <sighs> that's it. Okay, what the heck is this? Is this the exit? Holy cow. Oh god, there's more stairs, more stairs. How many stairs are there? Oh god. Oh, I'm back, okay. means do I find another memory some something something There's nothing here I can do. Oh, there it is. Thank God. I believed 
Hunter right away. You needed the secret stone as proof, problem. I can feel your light power within her, as well as my time power. Additionally, I sense that we share a blood connection. Ah, I see. In any case, Zelda, you had said that you needed to return to your era as soon as you possibly could. Yes. In my time, something terrible is happening. I need to get back there. But how do I do that? I don't even know how I got here in the first place. <laughs> it's like, she's like paying attention. Awakening. All right, nine more. All right, so the third tier might be somewhere around here. Oh, there it is.
Ultimately, the secret stone only amplifies your power. It doesn't suddenly grant you mastery and control. That's still up to you. That means, if you don't already know how to get yourself home, stories about the secret stones and a forbidden act called draconification. To swallow a secret stone is to become an immortal dragon, one blessed with eternal life. Interesting. Another way to reach the future, though not a very quick one. So you think these stories could hint at a solution to our dilemma? Yes. But there is still more to those tales. To become an immortal dragon is to lose oneself. That is why it is forbidden. I thought maybe this could lead to a solution. Some way to transcend time. But if you have to sacrifice your heart and mind, sacrifice what makes you, you. I'm sorry. I wish I could help more. we started. There's still hope. I think the answer, the answer to this problem lies in study and learning more about the nature of your power. I'm sure Sonya would be happy to help you. Okay. Any more left? Eight more, okay. All right, time to look for memory number four. myself with the spike. Right. 
Okay. Ooh, snap, I, I blew him out. Uh-oh, there's another one. Alright, that's a horse. I'm gonna ride it. I'm gonna ride this horse. Oh, I found it. There it is. That's Ganondorf. So the Gerudo serve Ganondorf. Ooh, what are these enemies? Are these Moldugas? Moldugas are approaching our position. It's more than we do not. It's a swarm. There are so many of them. But why would they? Man, you could take out a thousand of them with just that power? So sick. That last wiped out all the Molduga. How is that possible? So brute force will not be enough.
How interesting. Alright, here's our fifth tier. that a single male is born to the Gerudo every 100 years. Receiving such an appeal from you, a hero to his people and a king by birth, well, it is truly reassuring. It is my honor. When your Zonai ancestors first descended upon these lands long, long ago, they must have seemed to be gods. And now you rule as king, and have taken a Hyrulean woman as your wife. <laughs> your majesty has certainly risen above your admirable lineage. Most impressive. It is unfortunate that the noble Zonai no longer grace this world with their presence. All except you and your sister, that is. Even if something were to happen to me, both my kingdom and the peace it brings, these will endure for generations to come. Your actions today are appreciated, Ganondorf. I look forward to your future endeavors. You may leave. Your Majesty. Oh, it's about to go down. Or something like that. Oh, what a dramatic entry exit. Kinoru, I believe that man's heart holds many dark ambitions. Just his name, even that, it gives me pause. I am well aware of his evil nature. For that reason, and others, I want him close. It'll be easier to keep an eye on him. There is nothing to worry about. Alright, time to look for our sixth tier. Alright, here's our sixth tier.
what is this? Ooh, wow. Almost dropped the cup. Are you well? You seem a bit distracted. I apologize. I keep getting lost in my thoughts and thinking about how I can return home. With your power over time, if I were able to learn that kind of control, I might be one step closer to my era. I see. The secret is to think of it like drawing out the object's memory. You ask the object where it was, how it arrived where it is now, and then you coax them back to that original moment in time. The object's memory. I'm sure it will become almost like second nature, and you will be able to find your way home. But Zelda, there is more on your mind than just that. You, of course, do want to get back to your time. But you also desperately want to help us out in this era. Am I close to the truth? How did you know? <laughs> I do not believe it is possible to keep anything secret from Sonya. <laughs> oh, your concern is very sweet, Zelda. But listen, you can focus your attention on returning home. After all, you possess more than power over time. You have a sacred power that can dispel evil. Both of these powers will help you protect your own era. Queen Sonya! And, of course, you must make it home safe to put Link's mind at ease. Link? Uh, that is not a name I have heard. He is a royal knight. He had been originally appointed for my protection. But later, he became a hero by saving both me and Hyrule from a great evil. Oh, a hero is he? He is so very dedicated, and he refuses to back down from any challenge. He is very strong, and his heart is good and true. see that you have absolute faith in him. Hearing you speak so highly of Link, I find myself wanting to meet him as well. Indeed. I would also like to meet him. He must be quite the brave, courageous knight. What a picture Zelda paints of him. So the next one should be somewhere around here. Let's take a look. Alright. Right here already. Right, the next one should be around here somewhere. here. Okay, this must be it. Nope. Oh, there it is.
are alone as you requested. What was it you wanted to discuss with me in private? <laughs> you are far too trusting. Oh my god. <laughs> Ooh, no way. Oh my. I'm surprised to hear you say such a thing. That is quite out of character for the Zelda I know. But then you are a puppet of Ganondorf. Ooh, I knew there was something Did wrong. Did you really think we hadn't realized your deceit? So she's, so she's Ganondorf's puppet. So that's why Zelda has been causing. Ooh. Oh. Oh, you can't be serious. Wow, what a scene we saw here. Ganondorf killed Queen Sonya and... And then... Zelda is a puppet of Ganondorf. So that's why we see... We, we've been seeing Zelda causing trouble all over Hyrule the past few episodes. So yeah. Alright, let's head to the next memory. Alright, here's our next tier. We've got a few more left. So, Ganondorf is the Demon King. Oh. 
Wow, monsters everywhere. Wow, so we saw how Ganondorf became the Demon King, and how Hyrule is invaded with e with all evil and stuff. All right, let's move on to the next to the next tier. All right, here's our next tier. Ages. We just received word that the last free village in the Gerudo Desert has fallen. At this rate, the Demon King's army will overwhelm us. I understand. Our only hope is for me to defeat the Demon King. Bravo. The Demon King. He is not someone you can stop by yourself. Something I'd like to show you. Stand with me. 
I need all your aid. Time for our next tier. Okay, the next tier should be somewhere around here. There we go. Ooh, that's her grave. Sonia's grave. Oh, Zelda. Kinvaru, before you face the Demon King tomorrow, there is something I must tell you. I came, I came to this era. After finding a man underground. Go on. When I witnessed what the secret stone did to Ganondorf, at that moment, I knew for sure what we found underground, that was him. He was still alive, still powerful. He continues to live on, all the way into my time. In tomorrow's battle, we won't be able to defeat him. No matter how strong we think we are, he'll survive. And you... And you... that set us on this path. I must atone for my error in judgment. And above all else, I remain the King of Hyrule. As with any leader, it is my duty to safeguard and protect my people, even if I must risk my life. Possible for us to defeat Ganondorf. We rely on your knight and that legendary sword he carries. Our last line of defense will be Link. But remember, that was a future where you never appeared in this world. You are here now. Zelda, I believe there is a reason you were sent to us. 
Okay, so we hit our second to last tier.
Oh, what was that? Oh, there's a dragon. And it has the master sword on top of its head. Complete our last tier, then <coughs> we'll end the episode. And next week we can like um next week can, next week we can like get the max master sword and take out Ganondorf. How did I miss that? over here. Turbine power. Alright, do you need some electricity to do this? Alright, let's put this over here. Let's see what else we're gonna do. Okay, we're gonna do this one. Okay. And then we're gonna fly. Okay, we gotta stop this fan. Good to go.
All right, on to our last tier. Coming the immortal dragon.
All right, so we've completed Dragon's Tears. And next week, we're gonna like get the Master Sword and then we're gonna fight Ganondorf. And yep. So, wow, what's what scenes we've experienced in this walkthrough? We know that that there is a fake Zelda being controlled by Ganondorf, and that Raru and Queen Sonia were like parents to to Zelda, even though they're not parents. And yeah, it's that. All right, everybody. This is Gaming God. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and see ya.